Hi, I'm here with my pet ferret Heisenberg to introduce dimensions of a physical quantity. I'm just going to talk about the what that means and its notation. So I might say that my ferret Heisenberg has a mass m or perhaps a length length l and these variables m and l here represent the amount of mass or the exact length of the object and if I want to know its dimension I use this notation here with the brackets and now that refers to the dimension of M which we call capital M for mass and then if I want this this is now the dimension of L which is a length as an example we can say we really I release Heisenberg and he runs away from me because he doesn't really like me very much at some velocity v and covers some distance d in some time t now, now the dimension of velocity is a length per time it's not one of the fundamental quantities so its dimension is represented in terms of the other dimensions however the dimension of d is still a length and the dimension of t is still time. Now finally I might videotape Heisenberg as he runs away as I do experiments on him and then I can sort of map out his position function as a function of time which we might say was 5 plus 7t or something like that. So this is a position function. Its input is time, but its output is position, which is also a length. So I would represent that notation with brackets again, if I can do my brackets. The brackets of x of t is also a length, while the dimension of time itself was time. And so that's how we define dimensions and how we represent them and using the bracket notation.